Come on. Just fucking jump, man. <laughs> I've been doing this for like 20 minutes now. Well, not that long, but... Like, long enough to piss me off. It's been like 10 minutes or so. Oh my god. This, I don't think this is at all the way you're supposed to get out of this area. It's just the way that my dumbass is trying to do it for some reason. There. Jesus Christ. Fuck this place. I'm not coming back until I have to blow the goddamn space station up. Careful, Morgan. Gas alarm went off in the coolant chamber after you powered the reactor back up. The turbines are hydrogen cooled. Now they're leaking. You take a shot and it's a rock. It'll be like shooting a grenade. Worth. All better. Take out a service questionnaire at the front desk. So, then what am I doing? Uh, I'm gonna take this off just so I don't have to deal with it. Uh, go hear out Alex in his office. Oh, yeah. okay. now, while I'm here. Okay, well, I don't think it makes sense going to his office that way because I don't have a lot of stuff. I don't have a lot of stuff unlocked. Um, Warning dangerous level of explosive gas detected. Please evacuate and avoid all open flames or sparks until repairs can be made. Uh huh. So, as long as I don't shoot, I'll be okay. That's what you're saying, right? Warning. Dangerous level of explosive gas detected. Please evacuate and avoid all open flames or sparks until repairs can be made. Oh my god. It really does not. It, it's like, here, use the glue cannon to get to places you couldn't normally get to, and then it's like, uh, yeah, no, you can't do that. There, though. Warning. Dangerous level of See, I'm just trying to get detected. creative with it. Please the game's and like, avoid nah. all open flames <laughs> or sparks until repairs can be made. See? Like, that's what I was wanting to do. To fuck with Warning. It. Dangerous level of explosive gas detected. Please evacuate and avoid all open flames or sparks. Alright, so now we get to go back and see our brother. Wait, did I ever loot this? Apparently not. I don't know where his office would be. Probably on the same floor as mine, way back when, when I was at my office. But, I don't know. We'll find out. The nightmare's still down there, but I'm not really gonna worry about it if he can't get to me. What's the point? No. Oh, 
don't think I ever got in here, did I? No. Can't hack it either. Not sure if I ever saw this as well. Did I? down in cargo. Hey, listen, uh, did you order any employers from Earth? Order any what? Reployer. It's a machine. A uh, machine. What does it do? Well, I'm not sure. I was hoping that you could tell me. <laughs> Wait, is this some kind of a joke? I I'm, I'm busy. You're an industrial designer, right? So I thought you would know. You obviously don't understand what I do, and I didn't order any deployer. Reployer. Ask somebody in engineering. I did. I've been asking everyone. No one ordered it or knows anything about it. Weird. Well, perhaps I can come down this evening and take a look at it. That'd be great. Thanks, Lane. Yeah, no problem. <laughs> Doop -doo -doo. Trying to figure out what the hell that is. Okay, we're back in the lobby. It's been a while since I've been here. I believe it was the time where your medical condition was discussed, Chief Engineer Lucian. What the hell? Morgan, is that... I am January. Morgan Yu's personal operator. Talk about loving the sound of your own voice. All right, January. Is that Morgan's workstation? And the fabricator? Morgan, come up here when you get a chance. Chief Ilyushin, please do not... This is Dr. Igwe. Made it to your office. Igwe? What are you doing here? How did you survive? Chief Illusion. Well, I, Dr. Igwe. I would. What is that? Is... Is that you, Morgan? Hardly. This is January, Morgan's attempt at having a conscience. But as per usual, it's only evidence of his ego. There's a number of responses I can make to this, Chief Illusion. But we are pressed for time. And Dr. Igwe is already showing signs of anxiety and disorientation. Fine. Make yourself useful, Igwe. Stand watch and keep away from the fabricator. Yes, Chief Illusion. And, uh, January. Hmm. Huh. Multiple objectives now, huh? Equip anything, or is this just gonna be straight? Yeah. Dude, fuck off. Oh my lord. Oh, it's you. to get back to my office. <laughs>
How do I get back to my office? Um, I feel like I'm really close to it. Looks like it doesn't want me to be here, though. Um, I just came from life support. Right? It doesn't... It does not want me to go here. No. Not at all. Um, so it's gotta be the other reason, I guess. to go to the Arboretum. Hey, at least I know where to go. So it's on. Pacific time. Good. I'll be leaving another package for you after tomorrow's shift. Drop site? The lobby. Assuming it works. Of course it works. Three taps of the wrench. That'll pop it open. All of them will work that way by tomorrow. You're adorable when you get proud of your gadgets. Don't patronize me, Lily. Dr. Igwe, are you approaching the crew facilities? If so, this is a sentimental request, but my collection, the gallery of photos the others used to laugh at, each picture is a decryption key to a set of neural data, connectomes, the guests who came to the station. Among them, Leitner, the pianist, is, is dead now. We can't let those skills be lost. It's all that's left of them. Please, Morgan, if you can, I would be grateful. I'm sending you an audio file that will open this safe in my room. You can play it with your transcribe. No trick, just a gift from your big brother. It's the truth, like I promised. We were wild to dig it up. Someone wanted to hide it from you. My computer, another video. Give it a look and we'll talk. I'm simply giving you the password, assuming you haven't hacked your way in yet.
Alright, so what's this gonna be? Is it gonna be another version of me telling me not to do this? Alex. I found it. Uh, someone's trying to hide it along with what looks like a bug out, well, like a bug out bag. Should I be concerned about anything? It's still there, by the way. This is, we're using this in space. BTW. Checking out a missing key card. This should be your highest priorities. It's labeled EP101. Let me know as soon as you find anything. Alex. Okay, and she found it. If it's shut down or on standby, it could be anywhere. Do I have permission to begin a search? Are you certain this is... Are you certain this effort is this? Where would it be? Alex. You've made it my duty to keep everyone on the station in good physical condition. Last time I checked, sir, you were part of everyone on the station. By my account, you've missed the past five scheduled fitness tests. You're uncomfortable with some of the excuses, exercises, and performing them in front of the crew. I can schedule you in time of fitness where it's just two of us. You wouldn't be doing this just help yourself, but set an example for the whole staff. Thanks so much, Emma Beatty. Ooh. Good afternoon, Talos. Lunch is served in the cafeteria from 12 to 2 p.m. Please refer to the weekly upgrade for today's menu. It's even more prominent because of the duration in which these behaviors shifts are deployed. As requested, I did not discuss this with Morgan. Interestingly, Morgan seems unaware of these shifts. As an aside, I do not. I, I believe this poses interesting questions for other app applications of the neuromod. Not solely therapy, but a reconditioning. the Talus One research facility. What else? Why are we making this video? Right. <laughs> because my big brother is paranoid. Psychometric data is showing statistically significant variance in personality patterns between trial runs of the new neuromods. Whatever. I feel more like myself than ever. I mean, look at this. We did it, Alex. It's real. Enjoy it while you can. Because in a few minutes, it'll all be gone. And we strip out the neuromods and we set. I know. Including my memory of it. No way around it. Let's talk about the backup. So, the Typhon organisms have been producing an elaborate structure. Material is unknown, purpose unknown. And my gut tells me it's a kind of neural framework, but externalized. Still waiting on analysis to confirm. In the meantime, I've given Alex the design for a device I think could shut it down if it ever broke containment. Alex just has to grow a pair and commit. You don't have to take all the credit. What if it doesn't work? It'll work. Trust me. <laughs> what else are we going to do? Blow everything up? That won't save us. And if it does work, is it worth it? The people that come after us will be smarter, stronger, immortal. They can judge us if they want. But they'll know they exist because of the things we did. I'm ready. Do it. Hmm. Well, you have it. Everything I've done is what you've asked me to do. I didn't think you'd believe me unless you heard it from your own mouth. The tests, they changed you. Not a lot at first, but eventually, the constant stripping of your memory I didn't know who you were anymore. All I want is to have my brother back so we can finish what we started. The device you mentioned, it's an advanced version of the Null Wave. It's the only way to stop the Typhoon without destroying everything we've been working toward. We're just missing some scan data from the Coral to complete the design. Coral. Coral. Help me finish this, Morgan. From the Coral. Then, you can have my arming key. I don't believe you want to use it anymore, but you can have it. I left the chip set for you on my desk. 
You'll need to upgrade your psychoscope to scan the coral. I'll send you the scan locations. Hmm. Hmm. What do I want to do? I don't really know if people should be able to live, should be allowed to live forever. I don't know. Fuck. I guess... I guess I'll... Try to listen to myself. No. Ugh, another slot in this stupid helmet. I don't even know where to go to get that. Right here. Chipsets. I gotta use that. And I don't have any more. You know what? That's, that's whatever. Hidden mimics or the range. Um, double clicking doesn't work, I guess. Another weaver? How many weavers have I killed already? But if scanning the coral will grant you access to Alex's arming key, then perhaps it's the best course. Perhaps knowing the coral's purpose will reinforce your decision to destroy Talos One. Just be careful. We're running out of time. Am I scanning? Coral? I'm getting kinda low on ammo. Kinda. Fifty seven rounds. Directors as court whether the situation here. Suppose it was inevitable. 
this book we have us. That's why it's important we act quickly, decisively. They'll try to take this out of our hands, Morgan. Okay. Yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. I can't do anything about you. There's so much shit to fight. God, it's annoying. Look at all the fucking weavers. Oh my god. I couldn't fucking do anything there. I got stuck. Yeah, go ahead and just reload the save, please. I shouldn't even try to. I, I hate fighting in zero gravity. It is so. Fucking hitting me now. God bless. So much. Oh my God. Leave me alone. What even was it? What, what is? What is hitting me? I don't see a telepath anywhere. I don't know what it could be that's fucking shooting.
That was stupid. Those weavers are hard enough to fight as it is. They're not bad, but when they're in when you're in space, those fucking cystoids are everywhere. It is just ridiculous. Like, it is unreal how difficult it is to handle that. <laughs>